and this is Let's Get Talking. Today we are going to talk about common developmental articulation errors. These articulation patterns are rules created by many children to simplify their speech production. Basically, kids delete a sound or substitute sounds to simplify their speech. One example is final consonant devoicing, which is a fancy way of saying changing the final letter of a word. So instead of pig, your child might say pick. This should typically stop by about three years old. Another example is leaving off the final consonant of a word. So for example, a child might say da for dog or pit for pig. These kinds of errors should typically stop by about three years, three months. Another example is producing sounds in front of the mouth, which are normally made in the back. For the word go, the sound g comes from the back of the mouth. And children will typically say do. So they substitute the d sound for the g, and the d is produced in the front of the mouth. They may also say ta or ka. These errors should stop by about three and a half years old. Another error is dropping one of the syllables in a word to make it easier and simpler to produce. For example, a child might say telephone for telephone or effon for elephant. In both these cases, they're dropping the syllable left to make the production easier. Child might also leave off the first syllable of a word, such as in potato or banana. They might say tato instead of potato or nana instead of banana. These kinds of errors should stop by about age four. Another error is simplifying the production of a consonant blend when there's two or more consonants together in a word. For example, a child will say pain for plane or poon for spoon. This should stop by about approximately age four. Another error is substituting one sound for another to just make the whole production easier. For example, tish for fish or dope for soap or even do for zoo. These errors should stop between the ages of three and five. Lastly, the errors where a child will use the W or the Y sound and substitute them for the L and the R. This is called gliding of liquid. So the child will say one for run or weg for leg or even yeg for leg. These errors should stop by age five. All of these simplifications show that your child is actively learning the sound patterns of language. There is a range when speech sounds will be mastered and it is a gradual process. If these developmental speech errors persist longer than is typical, please see your pediatrician and a speech therapist should be consulted. I'm Mara Beth and see you next time on Let's Get Talking.